Now, on to our next special speaker. Uh, I don't know, it's a performance. It may not be short and sweet. It's Sericia Jackerson, who's gonna do a performance called If Only This Tree Could Talk. Sericia? I'm not crazy about history, <laughs> but I'm talking about Jeff Smith back in 1835. Eh, we'll see what it has to say. <laughs> uh, history's really not my thing. Huh? <laughs> Getting a little drowsy. Steph Smith climbs up on me to look out. There he oversees Old San Antonio, Cibolo Creek and Trail, and Gonzales. We can see the Mexican army, and they see Death Smith. Jeff Smith saw them too and told them how small their army is. And our army is huge. Go away home. The Mexican army was scared and they turned back around to old San Antonio. Jeff Smith called General Houston, General Austin, and to the army to warn them about the Mexican army. They quickly moved to Gonzales. And finally, Jeff Smith came back. And we continued our lookout. We see a lone male riding on a horse. Jeff Smith and I wondered, what's going on? And became very curious, and he chased him out. He found a secret paper. It was a secret enemy plan. I have to tell General Houston, I'm going to have to rush to Gonzales to show him the secret paper. And I waited for Jeff Smith until he came back. Finally, he came back and sat out on a limb, and I asked him, hey, what happened? And he told me that General Houston and the army burnt Gonzales down, and then moved east by water on the Gulf, and Jeff Smith had to go and help with the battle. I waited and waited for days on end. The months went by. And during those four months, I wondered, what is Jeff Smith doing? During that time, I could hear the cannonballs, the screaming, the fire, and the battle. I could only wonder what had happened. Finally, I saw Duff Smith riding back. He was coming my way, but I could see he was injured, he was exhausted, and sick. And I asked him what happened. And Duff Smith, he slowly climbed and he explained what had happened. We destroyed a bridge near the Gulf. The Mexican army was angry because they had to chase us to San Jacinto. There were 1,400 Mexican soldiers and only 1,900 of us, but we won the battle easily. It was only 18 minutes, and I was amazed. The Mexican army was disappointed and went back home. Jeff Smith told me, he said, I'm exhausted. My duties here are over, though. I'm ready to go home to my family. And I saw him right off. I watched him leave. I'm 100 years old, 200, 300 years old of an oak tree. I see I've lost some of my limbs over the years. Oh, wow. What a dream I just had about Def Smith. Wow, he was a soldier. He was a scout. He was a spy. He was a true hero in Texas history. He helped win the Texas independence 176 years ago. I'm so happy to know he was born 225 years ago. Now I can enjoy my history. Don't know where this came from. 
came from. Hmm. 